So guys, for the first step, you want to head over to search and then type in CMD. Then you want to run it as administrator. And then click on yes. Now once you're on this, we're going to type in SFC space forward slash scan now and then click on enter. Then you want to run this scan. We can run it in the background as you complete the next steps in the video. Now for the second step, you want to head over to search again and type in check for updates. Click on it. You want to click on check for updates and do the updates your computer may have. Now for the next step, if you're playing Call of Duty on Steam, you want to find it in your library. Then you want to right click on it, click on properties and then click on installed files. You want to click on verify integrity of game files. Now as this is loading, you want to click on browse. And then you want to find the Call of Duty.exe file. You want to right click on it and then click on properties and then click on compatibility. And then you want to tick run this program in compatibility mode, tick disable full screen optimizations and then tick run this program as an administrator and then click on OK. If you're playing on the Battle.net launcher, you want to head over to Call of Duty and then click on the gear icon and then click on scan and repair. Now for the next step, you want to head over to your graphics card driver software. So for me, I have an NVIDIA graphics card and I have GeForce Experience. If you have an AMD graphics card, you want to download the software that comes with that. So in my case, I'm just going to head over to search and type in GeForce Experience. Click on it. And then you want to click on the drivers tab. You want to click on check for updates and make sure they have the latest graphics card drivers installed. And also, if you're using GeForce Experience, you can click on home. And then if you see Call of Duty here, you can find it and then hover over it and click on details. And then you can click on the spanner. And then you want to set this to performance. Set this to performance and then click on apply. Now once you complete these three steps, the problem should be fixed. But if it's still not fixed, then you want to head over to search and type in add remove programs. Click on it. Now once you're on this, you want to look for Call of Duty. You might have to scroll down to find it. But once you find it, you want to click on the three dots and click on uninstall. Then uninstall it. Now you want to just re-download it again.